Good morning, everyone. Today we have our <clears throat> 2008 Cobia 256 center console, powered by a 350 horsepower Yamaha four-stroke engine. Uh, the boat shows well; uh, is in good condition. It does not come with the brand new trailer that you see it on. You can buy it if you need it, and we can quote that price for you uh, when you give us a call. As far as the gel coat, uh, it does have a fresh coat of bottom paint as well. Shell coat shows well, uh, made minor little issues like right here. Uh, the boat came to us in this product, in this condition, and uh, shows well. We did a quick buff and a wax. Oh, I'm sorry, we did not, but the previous owner did uh, about a three months ago in the early spring, and it's still holding a good shine to it. Currently the engine is in the up position because we're getting the power trim and tilt rebuilt. Uh, I'm sorry, brand new trim and tilt motor with a resealing the power trim and tilt itself. And that's why it's currently in the up position and not currently on the boat. But overall the engine shows well, no major paint issues on that. This side of the boat also shows very good I'm looking for some blemishes here there's no major repair areas let's just put it that way uh, and it has a nice dead rise to it for a 26 foot boat has a fold down ladder as you walk through the transom door the back cushion is probably the worst part of the boat as far as the upholstery because this is the one that wasn't covered with a cockpit you know, cover the red leaning post and the rest of it was that dot will need to be addressed. Live well here. Little cutting board there. Stainless uh, cup holders. Pop up cleats. Flush mounted stainless rod holders throughout. Fish lockers on both port and starboard with pump outs. They're insulated fish lockers. The dash. Uh, the gauges are in good condition. It shows about 500 hours. I don't have to keep batteries on right this sec. I'd say it's lacking in the GPS garment. You know, it's got this little 540S. What it really needs is something flush mounted right here. Nice little unit and do some nice hardcore fishing. Here's the leaning post in excellent condition. No rips or tears. Nice, still soft to the touch. The leaning post has a little foot bar there. And more rod holder storage here, as well as tackle box storage and gear in there. Boat has Lenco electric trim tabs, live well, raw water wash down, fresh water wash down as well with a little stern shower. Electronics box up here with a VHF radio in it nice wide space here to get up to the bow of the boat all the cushions up here are also in good pretty good shape minor little discoloring there but it's not ripped or tore and still soft to the touch you have storage under both port and starboard as well uh, bow cushions right there with drains in them more storage in here there's your fresh water pump I don't know if this leans back or not. Yep, more another cooler there to throw some uh, beverages in, and then the upholstery on this is also in great shape. Uh, only upholstery issue is that back bench seat, which we will be getting addressed here shortly. Forward anchor locker located here with an anchor 
and line in it. Pop-up nav lights. It does come with the factory T-top and a full enclosure that goes around the T-top. Canvas is in pretty good shape. It's in there. There are your uh, covers for your leaning post and cock and helm station cover, as well as your full enclosure. Pump out head with a toilet is in there with a macerator hookup. Little vent there, and there's your AM or AM FM CD player. Access behind that mirror to the cut to the uh, dash for repairs. We're going to get her in the water here as soon as we get the tr power trim and tilt addressed and uh, get that part of the video done. And we'll ha have it posted online once that's done. Thanks for watching. Guys, that's our 2008 Cobia 256 center console powered with the 350 Yamaha four stroke engine. Don't forget to follow our YouTube channel in the bottom right hand corner of this video to subscribe to the most up to date videos. You can find us on our Facebook page as well. Our phone number is 443 324 1368, and you can find us on the web at mdboatsales.com. It, you want to check to make sure this the boat is still available after watching the video, that's the best place to go. Our phone number once again is 443-324-1368. Thanks for watching and we'll see you out on the water.